guys, how are you? It's Lindy and welcome to a new video! In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how you can create... I'm gonna do that again, okay. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how you can get... What is wrong with me? In today's video, I am going to show you guys how you can create really realistic and looking freckles in under 5 minutes Maybe even in under 2 minutes because this is such an easy way And yes, I am wearing fake freckles right now, but my camera just doesn't show them when it's like from this far away I need to zoom in and then you can see them, but you're gonna see them in like a second so don't worry, I'm gonna show you. I've been wearing fake freckles um, a lot recently because I just think that they look incredibly cute. I do actually get freckles, but I only get freckles when I'm in the sun. And to be honest, I'm almost never in the sun because I avoid it at all costs. When I was younger, I just went in the sun every time I got the opportunity. Because back then I didn't really realize that um, the sun was actually a giant glowing murder monster but now i realize that so i don't want to get in the sun anymore <laughs> but when i was younger i got like a bunch of freckles on my face but now i don't because i'm never in the sun anymore so my solution to this problem is to just draw them myself on my face it is a lot healthier than actually going into the sun and burning my skin and dying at the age of 28 so you know, this is my solution to the problem. So yeah, anyways, if you guys are interested in seeing how to create your own freckles, then please keep on watching. Hello everybody, here I am, very up close and personal, but I kind of have to zoom in a lot because otherwise you won't be able to see the freckles. And that's kind of the entire point of this video. So, you know, I'm gonna just zoom in. So first off, I'm just going to start by applying my foundation and my concealer. And for the foundation, I'm using my Wet n Wild Photo Focus foundation. And for the concealer, I'm using the NYX HD concealer. So I'm just gonna do that right now. Okay, so my foundation and my concealer is on my face. I also quickly did my brows, which I now regret because they look horrible. And now you have to look at my horrible brows for the rest of the video. So I'm sorry. But anyways, we're now already going to continue on the freckles. We're not going to set our foundation yet. We're going to do that after we applied the freckles. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my cream contour palette from Makeup Revolution. And of course you can just use any cream contour palette that you own or that you like. This is actually the only one that I own so I'm just gonna use this one because I don't have any other options. So what I'm going to do, honestly this is so easy like I said before, it is so incredibly easy. Um, I'm going to take one of these sponges which are like stippling sponges, I don't know how you call them, you can buy them at like SFX stores and stuff. I bought mine online. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get this sponge and I'm going to dip it into the contour color that I want to use. And since freckles most of the time have kind of a warm tint to it, I'm going to put it in this one. Normally I use this one to contour my face because I am very pale so I need a cool toned contour color. But we're not going to contour our faces yet. We're going to add some freckles to our face. So I'm taking this color. And I'm just literally dipping the sponge in this color. So it's like on the sponge right now. And then I'm just literally going to take this sponge and dab it on the places where I want the freckles to be. So I focus mainly on the nose area because that's most of the times the place where you get the most freckles. But I'm also going to apply some freckles on my chin and a little bit on my forehead as well. And just a little bit around the cheek. Uh, basically just all over my head but mainly on this part and I'm doing that because I like the look of a lot of freckles and also in my opinion it looks more natural when you've got like 
freckles on different places as well and not just on this area because when I get freckles in summer I don't just get them here I get them basically everywhere so that's just what I'm going to do as well but of course if you just want freckles here you can just put those freckles there like do whatever you want of course so taking a sponge and putting it on my face So also on the chin and on the forehead and just random places like everywhere but again mainly focusing on this part. Like you've put too much product on your cheek you can just like take your finger and dab it a little bit or you could even take your sponge that you use to apply your makeup and just put it on top of it a little bit so now you've got something like this and i'm just going to take a really small brush and i'm pretty sure this is actually meant for like i don't know eyeliner or something and i'm just going to take this brush and dip it into the same contour color as I used for this. So I'm just putting a little bit on here. And I'm just dabbing off the remaining product on my hand. And then I'm going to use this to draw on some larger freckles. So I'm just placing this on random places as well. But again, mainly focusing on this area. So this is literally everything you have to do to get the fake freckles, like it's so easy. So what I'm now going to do is I'm just going to set my entire face with the NYX SFX setting powder. And you want to make sure that you dab the powder on your face and not like swipe it or swirl it. Because if you do that then you're just going to mess up your freckles, so make sure that you dab. So now I'm just going to contour my face using the NYX 3 Steps to Sculpt palette in the color light. And then I'm just going to highlight my face using the Love You So Mochi highlighter palette from NYX. And I'm going to take the pink shade. <laughs> I just quickly put on some lipstick to kind of tie this look together but my freckles are completely done no. so yeah as you can see this was so easy and it looks well in my opinion it looks pretty realistic I don't know what you guys think about it maybe you think it looks fake as fuck which is possible but I think it looks pretty um, real and also I've had like multiple people come up to me and be like Wait, since when do you have freckles? I, I never realized you had freckles. Wait, what? And I'm like, well, I, I got them since this morning because that's when I put them on my face. So yeah, I am zoomed out again because it was feeling a little bit too personal. But anyways, so this was how you can create your own fake freckles the really easy way. Honestly, this is so easy. The only thing you need is like a sponge cream contour and one brush and then you're done so yeah i really hope you guys like this video if you did please don't forget to give a thumbs up also don't forget to follow me on instagram my instagram name is at crystal lindy and also don't forget to subscribe to this youtube channel if you haven't subscribed yet because i would <coughs> because i would really appreciate it and I want to thank you guys for watching and I really hope to see you in my next video.
Bye-bye.